Longtime beloved Virginia Beach teacher who was badly injured while escaping a deadly house fire remembers the day that changed his life. Jay Lane and his son survived the fire by jumping from a second story window. Now as he recovers, Mr. Lane shares his story with Aaron e. LeBeau about his fight to take his life and how he's made his mark on students past and present. It is a story you'll see only on 13 News Now. It's like a monster. And I looked, I really feel like it chased us out the house. That monster was a fire that ripped through Jay Lane's parents' Richmond home. He and his son LJ barely escaped by climbing out of a second story window and jumping for their life. My parental instinct just took over saying, I got to get my child out of here. Uh, but if we were going to die, that was going to be our last time together. It was important that the two of us be together. They made it. But Jay's father and stepmother, John and Janet Lane, did not. <sighs> While Jay was able to escape the flames by leaping out of a window, the second story fall broke his back. But when I landed, bam! So I knew I wasn't paralyzed. I just thought I couldn't get up. And then he began to think about his son, LJ, who had yet to escape the fiery home. This can't be real. I can't get up. And I pleaded to God, please get my son off this roof. But taking heed to the voice of his father, LJ took a leap of faith. LJ, you got to jump. I'm hurt. You got to jump. You got to jump. And then through the smoke, I could see his hand and his burgundy pajama set. And he was going through the smoke and I was like, oh, thank God. Jay and his son were taken to Richmond area hospitals for treatment and to begin their long road to recovery. In the hospital is where he started getting an overwhelming amount of support from students and people in the community. Some through visits, others who raised thousands of dollars to help his family and cards that he still reads today. Tragedy is not always bad because it helps build for something else. From this tragedy, Jay was able to really see how much of an impact he made on people's lives outside of the classroom. To know that your life's work actually meant something to somebody. It's priceless. So what's next for him? Well, with his wife by his side. I, I loved him before. I love him more now. And now daily trips to the gym. He's on a tough road to recovery. Oh. But a road that he hopes will lead him back to the classroom and being Mr. Lane. We're truly two blessed human beings. I tell people, God's not done with me. That means I have more work to do. So that keeps me fighting for, to get my life back. Reporting, I'm Erin LeBeau, 13 News Now.